All right, doing about five minutes. Let's get it. Man, even though it's so much warmer than when it was like dead winter, <laughs> God, it still shocks me. It's amazing. But today we're going to be talking on take your own advice. How many of us really actually have life-changing advice in our mind? We could recite quotes, you know, give people little like nuggets of wisdom. We could, we can spout them off basically, but how many of us actually kind of take our own advice? And actually that, the example comes straight from this guy today. <laughs> Woo! Because I'm the guy who's constantly talking about great life advice. And I believe in what I talk about. But sometimes it's really easy to know things, but not genuinely live them. And that today, for me, I realized, I, I just talked about in a video on consumption. What you're consuming kind of is how you begin acting. What you let into your mind is how you begin, you know, living your life. Whether it's negative, positive, growth-minded, or just kind of like holds you in place. It's up to you. And for me, I had a lot of, you know, kind of boring work. Man, it's starting to rain now, a lot. <laughs> but I had a lot of boring work and I started off consuming, you know, plenty good content, learning about things. And then I got slowly dragged off course as the internet does into pretty just mind melting content, really like dumb, but entertaining content. And so I started, you know, not being able to think as well or as clearly. And so right there, I already knew the advice to take. I think many of us already know the steps we should take. We have great advice that would get us there and you know, can, if we actually take it, would improve our lives immensely. But man, <laughs> that's the hard part. Self-improvement, learning about self-improvement is the easy part, that's the fun part. That's the part that you know, I'm sure that many of us actually, uh, more people do than you know, don't but the percent that actually lives it and believes it, that's, you know, that's where it kind of, that's the difference between someone who's genuinely doing self-improvement and someone who is, you know, just doing it to kind of either be on a trend or feel, you know, get the sense of being like they're actually improving. There's a lot of water getting on the camera. I apologize if it's <laughs> blurring the, the lens, but uh, I'm sure it's, my beauty will shine through anyways, you know? <laughs> Not narcissistic at all, I swear. But many of us know the steps that we have to take. I think that we do. We have the advice, we know the steps, but we want to hear it from someone else or we want, you know, more assurance, I feel like. And learning to kind of let go and take some risk and actually just the difference really is just starting. Like for me, I know what I need to do. I need to not consume crappy content and instead either A, just let my mind be more creative and come up with its own things or B, consume good things that will, you know, make me live a better life. And so right there, you know, it's, but it's, you know, it's, there's tempting. It really is tempting. We want the things that, you know, maybe aren't the best for us because they're fun, because they give us that sense of pleasure in, you know, in the moment typically. And that is really why we are held back so much by ourselves is that we want that short-term pleasure and it gets in the way of our long-term pleasure, but, or our long-term fulfillment, I like to say, because genuinely being fulfilled versus just having some short-term pleasure is very, very different, I believe. Uh, you probably can't really see me at this point, or maybe you can because of all the, there's a lot of water on the lens from what I can see, <laughs> but all right, let's dunk. <sighs> Man, I want to see what you guys are seeing right now. It looks fine, it looks fine. Maybe my yapping was unnecessary there, but take your own advice. I'm sure that plenty of us have really good advice but we don't take it and so my advice to you today is take your own advice or take someone else's that otherwise you would have just listened to but genuinely work to implement it and live it but that's all for today and i hope you have enjoyed have a great day bye, -bye.